Hello everyone, for today's video, we will be talking about the symptoms, causes, diagnosis, treatment, and recovery of miscarriage in dogs. First, let me tell you what a miscarriage is. Miscarriage is the spontaneous resorption which stays inside the body or abortion which leaves the body of a dog's litter. This is sudden and irreversible and it typically results in a poor prognosis for any remaining fetuses. Though, most bitches may make a full recovery. A veterinarian may potentially be able to help your dog carry the rest of the litter to term if the necessary action is taken soon enough. Let's start with the symptoms of miscarriage in dogs. If the litter is reabsorbed at the start of the pregnancy, your dog may not exhibit any signs. But if a miscarriage occurs closer to the due date, a fetus will be aborted. The symptoms of miscarriage in dogs are unusual vaginal bleeding or vaginal discharge. Unusual vaginal bleeding is a typical sign of canine miscarriage. This bleeding is usually abundant. Color-wise, it tends to be a shade between deep green and black. It usually has a thick texture with pus in it, but sometimes it can be bloody and thin. If you detect an aggressively unpleasant smell emanating from your pet's vulva, Miscarriage could be the reason. Vomiting, contractions, expelled placental or fetal tissue, stomach pain, weight loss, and appetite loss are symptoms of miscarriage. Oftentimes, a dog owner doesn't realize that the bitch has miscarried as she may eat any expelled tissue before it is discovered. A dog who has suffered a miscarriage may be lethargic or depressed and may become dehydrated if she is refusing to eat or drink. Now, let's talk about the causes of miscarriage in dogs. There are many different reasons a pregnant dog may miscarry one or more of her puppies. These include infections such as brucellosis, herpes, neospora, or toxoplasmosis, low progesterone levels, nutritional deficiencies, fetal defects, response to medication, and hormonal imbalances. Hormonal imbalances are often responsible for miscarriages. Next is diagnosis of miscarriage in dogs. A miscarriage may go undiagnosed if the owner does not realize that the dog was pregnant. This is especially true at the start of the pregnancy, when the bitch is more likely to absorb the prenatal tissue and to show no sign of her condition. If you suspect that your dog has miscarried, bring her to the veterinarian. The veterinarian can test for the presence of fetuses through palpitation, radiographs, or ultrasound, which will reveal any puppies that are present. X-rays and ultrasounds are especially useful both for identifying uterine contents and for determining the viability of fetuses still present. Depending on the cause of the miscarriage, the veterinarian may recommend additional tests for infection or other underlying conditions which will need to be treated to ensure your dog's overall health. Next is treatment of miscarriage in dogs. Treatment for bitches who have miscarried is supportive and varies depending on circumstances. Restrict your dog's activity and make sure that she remains hydrated while she recovers. If any of the fetuses are still viable, the veterinarian will find a way to help your dog carry them to term. Otherwise, you will need to ensure that your dog has expelled all pregnancy-related tissues, which can be verified with an ultrasound. If the pregnancy was aborted due to an infection, your dog will require antibiotics. Any other underlying conditions will likewise need to be treated, and IV fluid therapy may be recommended if your dog is severely dehydrated. 
Lastly is recovery of miscarriage in dogs. Your dog will need extra attention from you while she recovers from her miscarriage. Most bitches show signs of depression following the loss of her litter, but given time, she should recover and return to her old self. Limit her activity during the first few days following the miscarriage, and ensure that she has access to clean, fresh water as well as a quiet, comfortable place where she can rest. Monitor vaginal discharge daily and alert the veterinarian if you notice anything unusual. As your dog recovers, the amount of discharge will decrease until it stops altogether. The veterinarian may recommend a follow-up examination depending on the cause of the miscarriage, especially if an infection was involved. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share our video.